Here with Thomas Goins, head coach of the Concordia women's soccer team after a, a 4 nothing win over Bethany and now 5-0. and A perfect run through your non-conference season. Uh, what does that mean for you right now? I, I think it's something that uh, I think you can take pride in. Uh, certainly uh, coming in with a, a blended group and trying to figure out an identity early in the year. Uh, you don't always anticipate winning out the start of your season. So we've had some tough games and some tough teams and every team we've seen plays a different style. So I think that's the hope for the off the priest to kind of the non-conference part of the season is that you, uh, you're you learning and you're growing. Um, so today was certainly a different type of challenge for us, but um, it's nice to be 5-0. and um, But as we told the girls, the real season starts Saturday. So, you know, this is something for at the end of the season we can brag about a little bit. Um, but you know, it's only something we have to look in the rearview mirror of now. I know coaches talk about responding to adversity. You, for you, it was responding to success and a, a big win mm -hmm. this past weekend. What did you think of the mindset coming off of that victory? Okay, you know, that's classic sport trap game, right? Where you put a lot of energy, focus, and uh, emotion into a result and you get it. So there's that release. Um, so it was certainly a challenge for the girls to rebound and get that uh, that same excitement, that same focus, that same energy. Um, and you can see that. I think in our first half we were a little slower than we wanted to be, um, a little kind of lethargic in some of the things we were looking for. Um, we challenged them in the second half to come out and uh, understand that GPAC is on the way, so you can't really come out and walk through matches. And in the second half they uh, really responded well. and style of play, run of play was just more of what we wanted for uh, who we are as a team. So I was happy with the game overall, um, but certainly uh, we're, we're going to have to make sure we stay focused and clean going forward. And you talked about start of conference play this weekend. Um, I'm sure this team is feeling pretty confident right yeah. now. How do you approach the next few days as you start, begin to look at the start of conference play? I think, you know, we're excited for it. I, I feel like we uh, we have talent enough to make a, a decent run uh, in the conference this year. Um, but, you know, it's going to be a, a com combination of um, positive results, um, quality play, and a little bit of luck as we need it uh, throughout the year whenever you play in a tough conference like we do. Um, so we're excited for where we're at and where, um, where we can see ourselves getting uh, at the end of the season. But it's going to be a one-game-at-a-time kind of thing. So uh, ultimately, we've got to go 1-0 on Saturday against a much-improved Mount Marty team. And uh, from there, uh, we have to focus on the next one. So from this point of the season, it's one game at a time. And if we do well 12 times, uh, maybe we'll get a chance to hold the trophy again.